Welcome along to Barbecue Life UK, my name's Tom. Today we're cooking spatchcock chicken on the Audi Kamado. If you're new here, then please do make sure you subscribe to the channel. If you're not new here, then thank you very much. Make sure you leave me a comment underneath letting me know what you want me to cook next. So you want to start by flipping your chicken over and then we're just cutting the skin either side of the spine and then take yourself a nice pair of scissors and you're just going to cut through the bones to cut the spine out. The reason we cut the skin is that they get caught in the scissors and it makes this a lot easier. So the reason we spatchcock a chicken is it evens out the cooking, makes things that cook a bit more even. So you just want to get it as flat as possible, but cutting the breastbone and then flatten it out. Now we're going to put some cuts into the meat, so this is going to help our rub penetrate and flavour the meat. So you just want to put some across the legs, up the thighs, and then across the breasts. Repeat this on the other side. Next you want to spray with some cooking oil, this helps our rub stick. And this is just a barbecue rub that I've added some poultry uh, seasonings to, a bit of thyme and a bit of sage. You want to cover that all over the bird, making sure you get it right into your slits. So next we want to get our rack in with our deflector. This is the original deflector that comes with the um, AK onto that. I'm going to be putting a drip pan. This is it just keeps the deflector a bit cleaner so that the drips go on there rather than onto the deflector itself. And then we're going to put our grill grate in and shut the lid and let it come up to temperature. So we've got my top vent about halfway open and my bottom vent is about three fingers. So we're aiming for about 200, 220, nice roasting temperature. So now we've come up to temperature, we're going to lay the chicken on right over the top of that drip pan so that any fat we get drips down onto that pan. And then close the lid and I'm expecting this to take about 40 minutes. So we're 45 minutes later, just going to check the temperature. We've reached an internal of 74 degrees, which is a safe temperature for chicken. So we're going to take this off and you want to let it rest for at least 10 minutes before carving. I apologise for the light in here, it's not the best light and the sun's getting pretty low. So first of all we're going to take the leg and the thigh off. You just want to cut through the skin, find the uh, joint in the bone, push through and then that thigh will come straight off. It's got a nice crispy skin and then nice and moist inside the breast. So this is a super easy cook any beginner can pick up and then right away through your your barbecue in life you're always going to be going back to a spatchcock chicken don't worry about a beer can chicken you don't want to cook it whole cut that spine out you don't eat that anyway get it flat and get it cooked spatchcock style it's the best way to to cook it on a barbecue let's give this a taste just still got that nice crispy skin Beautifully moist. Just keeping an eye on them temperatures, don't really get too high. It's gorgeous. So if you like what we're doing here at Barbecue Life UK, then please do subscribe to the channel. Leave us a like, leave us a comment, let us know what you think. I'm going to be leaving some more commando cooks. I'm going to leave one in the top of the comments, and you're going to get one at the end of the video. Check them out as well. See how versatile this piece of kit is, and enjoy yourself with it. Thank you very much.